Learn how to manage Google accounts on your Chromebook. Your Google account allows you to access and use various Google services like Gmail, YouTube and Google Maps with the same email address and password. If you have multiple Google accounts, you can manage them on your Chromebook. You can also set third-party app permissions on your Chromebook. You can add multiple Google accounts to use on your Chromebook, either your own or another person's. When you add an account, you can use it with websites and Android apps. At the bottom right of your Chromebook, select the time. Select Settings from the options displayed. In Settings, go to the Accounts section. At the top, select your Google account. Now select Add Google account and then follow the on-screen steps. Switching between Google accounts on your Chromebook takes just a few clicks. At the bottom right, select the time, select power, then sign out. Choose the Google account you want to use and enter your password. Signing out is simple. At the bottom right of your Chromebook screen, select the time, select power, and then click on sign out. If you want to remove a Google account from your Chromebook, go to the bottom right, select the time, and go to settings. In the accounts section at the top, Select the Google account that you want to remove. Next to the account name, select Menu. From the menu, select Remove this account. When you remove a Google account, it will only be removed from the Chromebook and you will be signed out of any apps and websites where you used that account. The Google account itself, including its data and settings, will still be signed in on other devices. Android apps, Chrome extensions, and websites that you use on your Chromebook may have access to your Google account. Here's what happens when you add a Google account to your Chromebook. The Android apps you use may have access to your email and contacts if you've given permission to access them. Unlike some Android apps, your Chrome extensions won't automatically have access to your info unless you grant permission for a specific extension. Websites that you visit on your Chromebook don't access your information unless the website has a Sign in with Google option. If you choose to sign in with your Google account, you get a list of permissions requested by the website. You can opt out of any of these steps. Apps, extensions and websites in Chrome and Google Play may use your Google accounts to personalize your experience, depending on permissions. If you have given an app access to your contacts, that app is able to see contacts from all your signed in Google accounts. To check which Android apps have access to your contacts, choose Settings, go to the Apps section, and then Google Play Store. Select Manage Android Preferences, followed by Apps and Notifications. Finally, click the drop down menu labeled Advanced. Select Permissions Manager and then Contacts to find out more and customize your settings.